Whoa, kitty. Stop right there. Don't eat that chocolate. It can be really dangerous for you. Dangerous? How? Well, let me break it down for you with a not-so-sweet question. Can chocolate actually be fatal for cats and dogs? Zoom in! If you have a dog or even a cat, you probably heard that chocolate is a big no-no. But why is something so delicious for us? Mm, so dangerous for our pets! Well, to keep it simple, Chocolate is made from cacao beans, which are packed with naturally occurring compounds. Among these, the two most important and dangerous for pets are theobromine and caffeine. Both of these belong to a group of chemicals called alkaloids, which are known for their stimulating effects on the body. Yes, when humans consume chocolate, theobromine and caffeine, it stimulates our central nervous system, causing our hearts to beat faster and our blood vessels to dilate. This can make us feel a bit more energetic, happier and even more alert to our surroundings. Because our human ancestors consumed a plant-based diet, our bodies have become highly efficient at metabolizing these compounds over time. As a result, the effects don't last long and any excess is flushed out safely. In pets, however, particularly cats and dogs, the situation is different. Due to their carnivorous evolutionary history, they didn't develop the same metabolic pathways to break down these chemicals. This means the process of metabolizing theobromine and caffeine is much slower, allowing these compounds to build up to toxic levels in their systems. This can lead to symptoms ranging from mild digestive upset like vomiting and diarrhea to restlessness and hyperactivity. In severe cases, chocolate poisoning can lead to heart failure or even demise. Dogs are especially at risk because they are naturally drawn to sweet and fatty foods. Cats, on the other hand, lack taste receptors for sweetness, so they are generally less interested in chocolate. However, if a curious cat does consume it, chocolate can be just as toxic for them. So, how much chocolate is too much? Well, the toxicity of chocolate depends on three things. The type of chocolate, the size of the pet and the amount eaten. Dark chocolate and unsweetened baker's chocolate are the most dangerous because they contain the highest concentrations of theobromine. Milk chocolate and white chocolate have lower levels but can still be harmful if consumed in large amounts. For instance, for a medium-sized dog, just about 28 grams of dark chocolate could cause severe symptoms and around 0.5 kilograms could be fatal. For a cat, even 28 grams of dark chocolate can be deadly due to their smaller size and higher sensitivity to theobromine. But remember my friends, chocolate isn't the only food that's dangerous for pets. Grapes, raisins, onions, garlic, caffeine and alcohol are also toxic. Even high salt or sugary foods can harm them over time. Therefore, when in doubt, it's best to stick to pet safe treats. And if you suspect that your pet has eaten chocolate, it's important to call your veterinarian right away. So, can chocolate be deadly for cats and dogs? Absolutely! Therefore, when it comes to sharing chocolate with pets, keep it to yourself. A little caution goes a long way in keeping your pets safe, healthy and happy. Trivia time! 
Did you know that in dogs, symptoms of chocolate poisoning can start to appear within 6 to 12 hours after they eat chocolate? Yes, and these symptoms can last up to 72 hours before they start to subside. Sketching time! Today's sketch of the day goes to Harsha K. Hope you learned the bitter truth about chocolate today. Until next time, it's me, Dr. Binox, zooming out. Never mind.